Hey guys, what is going on? It's Sam, back again. Today I thought I would take a minute real quick and show you guys my setup, uh, my computer and my CCTV. Show you guys what I'm working with here. So the first thing I want to show you is uh, my computer. I've got my large print keyboard here and um, monitor, I think it's 21 inch monitor. I actually would like a little bit bigger but um, you know that's what I've got right now. One thing I wanted to show though is uh, to talk about is Windows 7 and Windows 8 which is what this one is. Um, this is Windows 8 8.1 actually but um, they have a built-in screen magnifier and I used to have zoom text when I was on Windows XP and it, it's uh, it was expensive crazy expensive that software is like 300 plus dollars so when I got Windows 7 and found out that um, well first of all when I got Windows 7 forever ago zoom text wasn't compatible with it yet so I was kinda of panicked there for a little while what am I gonna do but I realized that Windows 7 and also Windows 8 now has a built-in screen magnifier and it actually has hotkeys. If you hold down the start button and you hit the plus button, you can zoom in. Let me get on something here so you guys can see. And we can zoom in pretty far. That's how far we can zoom in. So there's our music, uh, Adobe Photoshop, Adobe Premiere, Elements, Open Office, and I can read all those perfectly. Then if you hit the uh, minus button while you're holding on to the start button you can go in and out so those are the hot keys it also has down here at the bottom you can enable this window that will it's a static window it'll follow you everywhere if I click away from it it disappears and it leaves this little magnifying glass and that's always there you can put it off in the side here where it's not right in the middle and uh, it's like a quick access to the controls and I can zoom in here I can zoom out um, you have different views that you can do I prefer the full screen but you can do a lens which is like this and it just follows the mouse wherever you want it um, that's not my favorite because it's hard for me to do. There it is. We also have docked where it's at the top or the bottom. And I can move it to the top or the bottom. I think maybe even I can make it as big as I need to. I think I can even put it on the side. Yeah, okay. There you are. I don't like that either. Um, personally, for me, it's better in full screen. And then I prefer the hotkeys. Just easier than having to rely on this little magnifier. What I do is I minimize the magnifier and then just use the hotkeys. So I love that. Uh, so that is, is available in Windows 7 as well as Windows 8 and it even works in the start menu here. Works really, really well. So that right there saves me three plus hundred dollars that I don't have to go out and buy Zoom text. That's awesome. Alright, so next I want to show you guys my CCTV setup. Now you probably know CCTV stands for closed circuit television. And in this case, it's a closed circuit television that will magnify whatever you need. And this is it here. I have a special one, um, and I'll talk about it here in a second. Mine, I've got linked up to this monitor. So if I just change the input on the monitor, it goes to my CCTV. And uh, we'll just look at my phone here for something to look at. I've got the controls back here. I can zoom in. Let's see how much I can zoom all the way up to that, which is pretty good. It has uh, where I can jump zoom or I can do slow zooming more precise if I need to. 
We also have different contrasts. I can do black and white. I can do negative or color. Some people can read things better in negative. Um, it just depends. I prefer just to leave it on the color. It uh, can auto focus. So if I go in, if I change the distance of the subject, it will auto focus. And this is great. I can use this to read mail. Uh, most of the time I use it to read recipes on boxes or the cans, find out how long to, you know, cook the rice for, that kind of thing. I, uh, I've got it on a stand here that can move. It's got uh, complete XY movement here. If you're visually impaired, this is a must have. I can't read anything anymore. I can't read, I can't even read large print stuff without a magnifier. So if I have to read a lot, then this is the way to go. Or if I have to fill out a, some paperwork or write a check, this is what I need to use. So now to get a close look at it, take it off here and unwind it a little bit. Mine is actually called Jordy, uh, named after the guy on Star Trek with the, uh, the, the blind guy on Star Trek, Jordy LaForge. So these are Jordy glasses. You may have heard of them. They actually work uh, as they go on your head. I got them upside down. So it straps onto your head and you have lenses here, eyepieces that you can look through and I can see, let's see, let's look at the, uh... there, we're looking at the camera, we're looking at you guys, looking at this. <laughs> uh, but I can use this out and about, say if I want to look over there towards the couch to see what's going on over there. It's pretty shaky, let me steady it here. I can do that. So these work really, really well. I don't generally use them on my head um, for out and about viewing because it does help, I can see further, but the problem is that it's, it's not 3D. Everything is still 2D. So depth perception is really bad, and you see how shaky it gets. It's by far, by far better than my own eyes, I will say, definitely, and I'm very, very happy to have this. Uh, but what I use it for mainly is the CCTV. This was provided to me by the Department for the Blind here in Kentucky many, many years ago, and I, so I didn't have to pay for this. This unit itself is several, several hundred dollars. Uh, so I'm very thankful to them for providing that for me. And like I said, I use it all the time. All right, guys, there you go. That is my setup, my CCTV and my computer. As I said before, CCTV must have. And if you don't want to spend the 300 plus dollars for Zoom Text or one of those other kind of screen magnifying softwares, Windows 7. Windows 8 has it built in, and it works great. So, all right, guys, this is Sam, and I'll see you next time.